Kevin and I met in college. We were both music majors, so we had a class together, well, many classes together, and we saw each other about every day since freshman year. When we met, we both didn't know each other, and we sat across the classroom and never talked the whole first semester. Our relationship first started as friends of friends when we first started hanging out, even though we were classmates. And um, the more we hung out with each other's friends, we just noticed that we wanted to hang out and do the same thing. Kevin has charisma like no other person. He's very charming. He could talk to any person and become friends with them. And it was that nature and that characteristic that really opened my heart to him and allowed my friendship to develop into something further. Whenever I think of Hannah, it's hard to think about one characteristic. I think of various things that make me happy. But the big thing that I like about her the most is how caring and authentic she can be for within any situation, whether it be something simple or very heartfelt. As a father, he is exactly what you would dream of as a kid. Not only is he your best friend, but he has the kind discipline that is there for guidance and love and respect and to help his family grow into healthy, happy, fulfilled people. I didn't know how beautiful life was until I saw the mother of my child smile to the child every day. She's loving, caring, sweet, she's honey. Anything I thought I knew about patience and love and care, I was retaught instantly seeing Anna become a mother. She did it just very naturally. Right now, I would always say to trust Kevin, listen to Kevin, to quiet the inner voice because uh, if I'm ever doubting myself, it's Kevin that's going to be there to reassure me and guide me and really focus my intentions on where they should be and to trust that. Kevin, 10 years from now, we need to stop overanalyzing and letting every day happen. Don't think about the future. Don't think about the past. Think about today and the present because that's the gift that I need to admire every day. I'll give you my everything. Not much, but it's all I have. You know, we could run to a place where we belong. But I need you there with me to go on. Sometimes I life the way I used to see it and I think that's a blessing because it's taught me what true love is and how to care for someone deep down inside and I thank you every day of my life for keeping me grounded because I love you for everything that you do for me and with me. I'm so proud of you and the man that you have grown into since we first met. Uh, you've really blossomed into an incredible, unstoppable person, and I couldn't be more proud to be your wife. Planning this wedding has taught us that things can get more stressful, unexpectedly, and fast. But one thing for sure is keeping our cool in stressful situations has got us through the little mountains that we've had to climb so far. And we just gotta keep pushing through. And as we say, we're not here to always have a good time, but we're here to make each other better so we can have a good time.